Hello everyone. Today we will uh, define the value of uh, NRV that uh, how a, a uh, NRV do the work. So let us start here. So you are uh, seeing there that uh, one NRV that uh, made by diplomatic and this is the function of that. Uh, this is the pressure point when you will give, give the pressure. So this point pressure will come inside directly in, inside and uh, other point this is this is the NRV point phase point. So, when you will get, uh, give the pressure from the back side, I show you that uh, this is the point of your, this double P you are seeing here. So, the, when you will give the pressure uh, here, so that time, uh, that time your plunger will uh, go uh, uh, forward side. So, as well as give the pressure, so it will work. So, we will show you that uh, how to create a pressure, how to make the pressure and how, how a, a NRV work here. So please wait. Now we are we are trying to give the uh, only pneumatic pressure here. So you can see that uh, this is open a little bit, but we will give the hydraulic pressure. So uh, you know that uh, uh, pneumatic pressure is around uh, pneumatic pressure around seven kilograms uh, only, but uh, hydraulic pressure is more than that uh, one ten or ninety. So now this is the NRV same. The uh, what NRV NRV you uh, seen before. So, this is the main function that this is the plan that it will work uh, front uh, forward and move and this is uh, you can see here uh, that this is the piston of this when you will push uh, that uh, NRV we have given the pressure from here but now is this uh, NRV we will give the pressure from the back side the system is uh, the same when you will uh, give the pressure here so uh, this piston will work and it will go forward and as well as it will be forward, uh, forward, so that time uh, your oil will come to through this and go to the into the your cylinder. And as you uh, drop your pressure here, so that time this spring will work and this uh, this piston will move backward side. So this NRV will be close itself. So simple that NRV means that uh, uh, no return valve. So when you will give the pressure from one end. So, uh, when uh, NRV will open, open, that time it will work, otherwise it will be closed ever. Here you can see that uh, this is the cylinder. Uh, this is the, our uh, cylinder for our um, uh, injection molding machine. And uh, this is the big, big face, big, big piston here. So, it will be work. We will fix this part at the machine, uh, uh, bottom of your cavity uh, face. So, when it, it will be fixed, that time it will be rotated, it will be moved. Uh, close and upward and forward. So now you can see that uh, this is the four hole for your big shaft. So so your press will work. Uh, we will try it here. So uh, when it will be go upside, so that time press will go up and mold will open. When it will be go downside, so that time mold will be closed and it need to tight your mold with locking pressure. So now we will see here that uh, how it will work. So you can see here that when you will give the pressure here, suppose you can see that one more point here. So when, because here is the piston uh, and seal is here. So when we will, suppose that this is fixed now. So we, we are giving the pressure here. So that time uh, your hydraulic oil enter here. So uh, hydraulic, uh, hydraulic pressure will press here, push this and it will be go because it is fixed. So it will be go upside because the oil is filling here. It will be go, 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 go. What distance we need and we are controlling with proximity uh, micro or some limit switch or uh, other our programming time. That time it will be stopped itself. And after when we need to close our machine, that time your peripheral valve, this valve will be open and your this uh, also will be uh, work. Uh, but this time reverse direction it will be go in tank. So last time we have discussed about uh, the valve working. So I told you that uh, what is the tank and what is the drain and what is the pressure there. So next time uh, another video I will show you again. So that time uh, now this time when it is going downside this is uh, met with P uh, with T sorry that uh, it will be drained to the tank and here that pressure will come here and this valve will be open. So this uh, this plunger will open now and oil, free oil that uh, you remember that uh, every time uh, your your uh, hydraulic tank height should be more than your this way. The surface 
of your if you want uh, if you will go with the level so tank level will be more than this so tank uh, the oil will come uh, to here so as well as when uh, it will be drained so the pressure or weight of your uh, press will push this downside so be, because this is now open so uh, 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 when it, it will be go downside so vacuum will create here so oil will come inside and what what oil is here so that oil will be uh, that oil will be uh, go to drain to tank so now when it will be closed suppose it is uh, go down uh, so at the last position when mold is closed to totally so that time it will be closed that uh, that uh, valve will return itself at, as, as per our programming and we we have to give that oil pressure from here this is the locking pressure what pressure we need so this is the hole directly inside you can see so we will uh, put uh, one pipe, pipe here to lock the pressure how much we want so we, we, we can give that 130 or 120 what is the requirement of our mold yeah all pressure we, we will select our uh, as per our requirement so now when uh, pressure will come suppose that 140 we have set it so that time it uh, as well as uh, pressure will reach around 140 so pressure will be closed and it will it and because uh, the in our hydraulic system that check valve is there so pressure will not return there and rv will be there in in our system so many types of inrv in the market and we use in our machinery so now when it will be closed so our your your injection can be proceed so now simple way the when it will be open that time again same procedure it will first time it will be take the uh, little bit uh, for microsecond current will come in this valve and uh, pressure will leak is from here and it will be open itself so what oil you have so that will be go down uh, from here to there because pressure will come to here when pressure will come here so that time it will be go upside when it will be go upside right so that time this uh, oil what we have filled here so that will be go one to go uh, uh, to go to drain drain in our system if suppose that you are, you are uh, facing some problem of your pressure dropping so you have to check that seal first only seal of your piston sometime sometime your piston this because uh, this is a uh, heavy th thing have a uh, heavy item so we made uh, uh, from one pipe so after taking the wipe we block this both side so maybe that some welding or some uh, some spot in, inside of this so pressure this is, this is the cause, cause of your pressure dropping first uh, first uh, major part that your seal is broken and other that your nrv is not going proper uh, proper way and otherwise your spring is broken so it is not going back so only three or four procedures are there to check your locking valve uh, and uh, we will tell you that because we are using here piston that we have, if we use the piston type that seal type cylinder so no need of uh, side cylinder because the two uh, two portion or two met method are in our injection molding if we fix two cylinder so no need uh, no need of this piston if we are using only this uh, this, this piston in our cylinder so we need uh, no need and otherwise it is flat so that time we need i show you that cylinder also you can see here that this is the cylinder what uh, we have uh, tell you that uh, here that you can say that this is a flat so this time no need of this uh, this point we will use this point as to uh, drain our air that uh, some time air uh, will enter in this your uh, system so we, we, we need some uh, air point so now that uh, how it will work so when you put two cylinder in the in your press they will they will work to take the press up down and down downside uh, portion when when they will work suppose your press is going upside down this is uh, upside so cylinder will work or and that time only this peripheral valve we you uh, we, we can say that peripheral valve surge valve and nrb all are set but we use mostly the name of peripheral valve in our system in hydraulic system also so here we will use that uh, surge valve or peripheral valve so peripheral valve will open this time when it will be go upside when it will become downside also that time we have used this this will be open and uh, that cylinder will come down so it will be come down 
that salt slide uh, side cylinder will come down. So that time it will be come down the pressure with the pressure of that cylinder and weight of your uh, your press. So when it will come down that uh, that this time this is the full. So that time after that this will be closed and it will be returning back here. So when it will be returned, so that time your again your this this hole will work and your uh, oil will fill here with pressure. So locking time the, your big cylinder will work and downside and upside movement we will cover with our uh, side cylinder. What is the reason that we make this is a big cylinder? Do you know that uh, if your cylinder uh, area will be more, so force will be built there. So more force will be because when you will inject your some uh, items in your uh, mold, so that time need more pressure. So suppose that one 10 pressure is there, there and the, if this uh, diameter is very short that uh, some uh, suppose that uh, 100 di uh, 50 mm we need uh, we put this. So press will not close with that press size this uh, around uh, you can see that a 500 into 500. So that time it will not work and only pressure will be uh, at the bottom only 50 mm. Uh, if we will we, we go with this uh, type of uh, our uh, piston. So pressure will come to at the, this point and this this is closed with the full pressure of your hydraulic, uh, hydraulic oil. So we need if our cylinder I, uh, piston ID uh, OD is very more and we are taking the big cylinder. So it will be take the uh, more force. So guys I hope that you understand what is the means of uh, today. So now if you have some query so please give the comments uh, and like and share our video. Thank you, thank you very much.